Hello and welcome. Over the next two minutes, we will show you how you can easily deploy a Silver Peak appliance as well as a Palo Alto firewall onto a NodeGrid gate SR and thus easily create an edge platform which provides SD-WAN capabilities as well as an enterprise class firewall which you might want to deploy in your own environment. The solution which we're going to use is, as I mentioned, is the gate SR as a hardware platform and our ZP cloud. The gate SR is already prepared, um, means we have already deployed the firmware version on it and the unit in itself is configured. What you're going to see now is our network configuration for this specific deployment. We have multiple VAN interfaces which are using the ETH0, an LTE interface as well as a fiber connectivity. Currently on the deployments we just have one Ubuntu server deployed which is currently not running. Using our ZP Cloud instance, we store the required ISOs and virtual machine files in our extended storage. You can see here in the ISO file, we have three separate ISO files or QCAL files, which we're going to use to deploy the virtual machines. Under profiles, you can see our predefined Silver Peak and Palo Alto template, which is available to all of our customers. When you navigate into the template, you can see that we use multiple variables which are defined in our ZP Cloud instance. If you go to custom fields, you can see here again the custom fields and their values. We use these values to deploy and configure the virtual machine when we apply it to the unit. So when you go to devices, you can select your device, you can select the template and you just click on save to apply the template. This will now push the configuration down to the node grid and the node grid will automatically pull down the ISO files and instantiate the virtual machines. You can see here, this was successful and we will get a positive feedback in our cloud instance that the virtual machines were successfully deployed. When we go now back to the interface of our node grid, you can directly see that the two VMs are running. And if we drill down to the Silver Peak VM, you can see that it's currently at its configuration stage. An administrator could now navigate into and finalize the configuration. Thank you very much, and I hope you enjoyed this short video.